<laughs> what? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Let's see now. Hmm. I see. And listen up. Listen to me. <laughs> okay, back to work. <laughs> Ready to go? Yeah, let's do this. There's a Legiana in the ancient forest, and nobody knows why. I rounded up all the eyewitness data available. Follow me. Legiana tracks. No mistake, it's really here. Does the forest seem off to you today? Let's keep going. It feels a little weird now that the Elder Crossing investigation's done. It's exciting too, though. I wonder what comes next. Quiet. What gives? I haven't seen so much as a bug. Where are the birds? Maybe something's got them all spooked? Those tracks were headed west, partner. Looks like we're heading in the right direction. It's gotta be up ahead. Plus, that gives me time to, uh... I've got my own little investigation to do. That's part of why I wanted to come to the New World in the first place. Which reminds me, you never told me what your reason was. Hold on. Looks like we're close. Guess story time will have to wait. Legiana tracks here too.
that everyone's here, let us begin. We have a serious topic to discuss. As such, I've assembled the Fleet Masters, along with the First Fleet Field Team members I've been able to reach. Now, I'm sure that you are all aware by now that Legiana have been leaving the New World in droves. Fla now that everyone's here, let us begin. We have a serious topic to discuss. As such, I've assembled the Fleet Masters, along with the First Fleet Field Team members I've been able to reach. Why they've begun crossing the ocean is an ecological mystery. Either something has begun to affect the biological nature of the Legiana, or they've been driven out by some change in their habitat, some anomaly that has stimulated them to migrate beyond the sea. Beyond the sea? <laughs> Commander? <laughs> Just some deja vu. <clears throat> so, thoughts? Ha! Do you even need to ask? I can tell by that fire in your eyes that your mind's already made up. It's not just you, Commander. I think we've all gotten tired of following the same old routine lately. Good. And I hereby declare we focus all available resources on investigating this Legiana issue. Effective immediately. Oh, now we're talking! <laughs> Commander, sir. We were thinking that if we follow the migrating Legiana, we should be able to discover somewhere to land. Like a new island, even. So, we go by ship. Or, better yet... Something a little more... stimulating? Air travel's our specialty, after all. Yes, the Third Fleet's airship would allow us to spot the best landing area, and help us get an idea of the surroundings. That settles it then. I'll be choosing who to dispatch, but I need you to stay and watch over everyone here. I'll need hands from the Provisions and Technology Divisions. We'll need your help to set up a forward operating base. And you two. Tell your fleet to ready themselves. Once your preparations are complete, assemble at the council table. We may not know what lies out there, but that's no reason to falter. Just like the star-guided youth of legend, we must always press on. Good luck, everyone, and may the Sapphire Star light your way. All right, then. Dismissed. It's time for the next big step. Head to the council table when you're ready. Okay. <laughs> well, off you go. Yo! Your partner's already prepping. She's with the Fleet Master. They're outside. You're certain? Yes. The clouds were headed in the same direction as the Legiana. The wind was blowing toward the northwest that day, so... <sighs> hey! Prepared? Just like the Fifth's banner. Luck's on our side. Yeah. I can't wait to get started. We didn't come all the way out for nothing. We must keep looking. Agreed. Hey. 
Legiana, huh? And we have no idea where they're going? Heard some kind of rumor about an island. Yeah? That'd be pretty exciting, huh? <laughs> Getting worse. Hold on tight. Yeah. Partner! I'm all right. But more importantly, look! An island! Wait. That is no island. You're right. It's a land map. It's too dangerous to continue. Uh, but we're almost there! We must regroup. You two, inside. Let's go. Lead the way. We'll find a place for the ship to land. this snow and it's freezing we can't stay out in this cold let's set up camp before we freeze to death we can change into something warmer while we're at it the commander procured some cold weather gear for us <sighs> better but it's still so cold. This place is something else. Let's start looking for a good spot to land the airship. Let's slip through here. Those tracks look like fin marks. I remember seeing ones just like it in the New World. Definitely large monster tracks.
I think we found our first tracks.
think they saw us. Nice work. Base is coming along well. The Legiana, they're here? <laughs> yes, we found their tracks. There's no mistaking it. Hmm. We'll need to ramp up this investigation. For now, let's get our base camp up and running. Assemble at the council table. We need to talk things over. Yes, sir. Exciting! Let me thank you again for the good work you did on reconnaissance. The location you found was perfect. You two really did a fine job. Now that we've laid the groundwork, we need to shore up our defenses before we can ramp up our Legion investigation. I've already made an urgent requisition to Astera for construction materials. The transport is prepared to sail here in a few days' time. But of course, this is uncharted territory. And there's no guarantee that the transport will be able to find safe passage after they land. The landing point is quite a distance from the forward operating base, so I'd like for you to investigate the surrounding area. <laughs> forward operating base and surrounding area. It lacks a bit of punch when I put it like that. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. How about we call this base Celiana, and the surrounding area can be called the Horfrost Reach. Celiana? That's a wonderful name, Commander. Now then. I want you to conduct an expedition into the Horfrost Breach and ensure that the area is safe for passage. I trust you to respond sensibly to any threats you may find out there. Take this as a good opportunity to get a lay of the land, too. Don't let your guard down, and don't forget your cold weather gear. Good luck out there. Our first priorities are setting up base and securing that supply route. Pretty good at climbing roots and rocks out here. Still can't hold a candle to the tracker, though. She's a free climbing pro. It's amazing that she was the first one to ever scale the Great Ravine. They lead this way. Looks like the path is blocked. Could be the work of whatever's left these tracks. It's completely blocked. Oh. <laughs> 
about this? Ah, uh, over there. Okay. Sir, it's going well. Hey! Hey! Heard you took care of some rough work out there. How'd everything go? Splendid, as usual. Now we can begin our investigation. Yep. Just think. This freezing cold place was waiting out here for us all this time. Who knows what secrets this land has in store for us. Whether we like it or not, we're going to find out. <clears throat> well then, I'm heading back to Astera. Seriously? Someone needs to stay and look over Astera. So I was thinking, this time, you can take the lead. Me? <laughs> Come on. It's not for me. As long as you're here, everything will be fine, right? Besides, ordering someone to be a commander doesn't make them one. <laughs> Maybe so. But... This place needs a strong leader to guide it. They'll need you here to guide them. Yes, sir. We'll need you too. All right, well, let's get started. We've got a full house here in Celiana now. And our Legiana investigation has gone into full swing. So, before we get ahead of ourselves, how about we hear from our newest members? First up, provisions. Our new deputy here will take care of the stockpile in Celiana. Whatever you need, I got it by the pile. And for all your melding needs, Scram here's got you covered. Swing by any time to see what's stirring. Next, the captain's best sailor here will be managing shipment requests for the Argosy and harvest requests for botanical research. You come see me anytime. And last but not least, our chef. We got the best of the best for our canteen in Celiana. As some of you may know, she's the Astera chef's former mentor, and she's come out of retirement to help us out. Take charge of the resource center as usual. You can still count on me for all your hunter gear. And what do you know? The chief's made it out here too. Don't look so surprised. You know that I'd go anywhere in the noble pursuit of knowledge. And finally, there's me. I'll be keeping everyone safe and sound. And all relax while I'm on watch. Well, now that the niceties are out of the way, back to our objective. We've got to figure out why the Legiana have migrated here. And to do that, we've got to find those Legiana. First, I'd like the field team to conduct an expedition into what we're now calling the Hoarfrost Reach. You might find a clue about the Legiana crossing by following any tracks that they may have left out there. Don't forget that this is still uncharted territory. Don't let me catch you being reckless out there. Yes, sir. We'll get started on the expedition right away. I'll be going, too. There's quite a lot I need to see for myself out there. All right, then. Just don't skimp on sending me regular status updates. I guess that about wraps things up, then. Well, let's get to it, I guess. I should get moving.
I'm heading this way. See you around. Okay, let's find those Legiana tracks, Pard. Legiana tracks. They look like they're heading... This way. More tracks. We're going the right way. Below. Look, the scout flies are headed down into that cavern. Look who it is. Huh? Huh. Funny that you two would end up here. Yeah. We found some tracks and followed the scout flies. Oh. If that's the case, then we're both heading the same way. You sure about that? I mean, other than that opening, I can't find any other place to go. I'd like to have a look, but... It'll have to wait. <laughs> Always ready. You, it's me. Okay. Be careful, Pard!
Well, shall we? Watch your step. Many of our fleets. No, this is older than the commission itself. <laughs> Found you. Take a look at this shard. Never seen anything like it. This handwriting. You've seen it? It was long before the first fleet was dispatched. There was an explorer searching for the new world. <laughs> I hoped our paths would cross again. Let's see. Monsters displaying disturbing behavior. Song. Song? I found a shard. I'm not sure how it was created. I need to check. Sorry, but I can't read the rest. The Legiana's sudden migration. And Song. These notes we found. It's happening right now. So this thing might be the key to this whole mystery. <sighs> Yo! <laughs> We've been looking all over for you guys. Whoa, look at this old relic. Um, can you focus on your job, huh? please? Sorry. Astera is calling back its hunters. We need to return ASAP. What? Uh, my grandfathers. I think they're the same. Wait. You're telling me he brought this from the New World? Mm. I thought I was getting closer to the truth. Then we'll get there together. You want to know what really happened, right? Same as me. We won't let this get away from us. Thanks. But... Kid, you either come with me or go home. Don't second-guess yourself. There's no time. Hey, don't worry. I can fill in for you and help while you're gone. For the time being, allow me to be your handler. Sound good? An offer from the best handler in Astera? <laughs> You'd be crazy to refuse. Everyone, thank you so much. <laughs> Glad to have a partner. <laughs> have fun. Okay, looks like we're done here. Let's go. Good luck. <laughs> This won't be for nothing. Partner, take care. <laughs> Thanks for coming on such short notice. Now, as for why I called you back... Hold on. Where's the little gourmand? Still finishing off a few steaks at the canteen? Actually, she's engaged in another investigation at the moment. I'll be supporting her partner for the time being. I see. Very well, then. Let me fill you in. There have been reports of unidentified subspecies in the Wildspire Waste and the Coral Highlands. One seems to be a subspecies of Paolumu, and the other of Puke Puke. The Analytics Division theorizes that the sudden appearance of new subspecies may be linked to whatever caused the Legiana crossing. Their theory is that some sort of change in the environment has upset their normal behavior. Therefore, we need to take these developments seriously. Seeing as how you'd witnessed the altered Legiana firsthand, I thought you'd be perfect. Understood. Then my temporary partner here will hunt the subspecies, while I provide support and compile detailed reports for analytics. Very well. I'm counting on you two. 
Commencing the Coral Puke Puke investigation now. The Fifth Fleet's A-list hunter will take point while I keep record. The field team has already gathered tracks. Let's follow the scout flies. Astera and prepare for the next investigation. Commencing the Nightshade Palulumu investigation now. The Fifth Fleet's A-list hunter will take point while I keep record. The field team has already gathered tracks. Let's follow the scout flies.
Back with us? That's a relief. Let's continue the hunt. There is some connection to these subspecies in the Legion. Good work out there. Splendid job. <laughs> Welcome back. Have a minute. Commencing the rescue operation. Your first objective is to eliminate the burial threat. I'll have the scout flies follow their footprints. Do you suppose they've managed to learn anything about the shipwreck and that shard? I can't wait to hear all about it. Er, <clears throat> let's hurry. 
We need to confirm their safety. They're close, which also means...
find those two and complete our mission. Search, we noticed a Baryoth was nearby, so we hid. Thanks to you, we were able to have a really good look around. <laughs> For one thing, the ship was covered in gashes from an attack. A Baryoth isn't capable of something like that. It came from something far, far more dangerous living here. Then, we found this. It looks new. Whatever made this must be close. How about you? Find out anything? Frozen monsters. Huh. Baryoths aren't known for that sort of thing. So then... Everyone thought it was just a mere myth. But there it is. Valkana. What now? Believe in yourself, little moon. You are closing in on the truth. But... You're going to need his help. That elder dragon is going to be a problem. <sighs> We'll meet soon. Whatever happens, please, please be careful. <laughs> Let's go, partner. Thanks for assembling on such short notice. There's been a bit of alarming news from the hinterlands. Let the fifth take it from here. Thank you, sir. See, recently we've been discovering monsters in the Hoarfrost Reach that have been completely frozen. And we finally identified the culprit. An elder dragon by the looks of it. This elder dragon was last seen flying across the sea, roughly in the direction of where we are now. It's likely already here in the New World. So, there you have it. I think it would be best if we started looking into precautionary measures. I see. Thanks to our trusty tracker's meticulous observations, we think we've correctly identified the monster from among our records. It is an elder dragon known as Velkana, the Iceborne Wyvern. Very few sightings have ever been officially recorded. But they have all been by mountaineers or explorers that ventured deep into the bleakest, coldest extremes in the world. Records say it could freeze other creatures with the merest breath or flap of its wings, 
We'd always assumed these reports were exaggerated. If an elder dragon this powerful has awoken, then it's all but proof of some drastic change in the environment. I agree, Commander. If I'm not mistaken, we can consider the Legiana crossing to be the clearest sign of that change. You're suggesting that the Legiana have led us to the cause of all this, then? Yeah, but first, we need to find this thing. I want the field team to split up and search each region for any unusual signs. Yes, sir. We'll divide our resources and conduct a thorough investigation. I trust you'll take care of threats from any unknown monsters you might find out there. And finally, provisions. We need to prepare for the worst. See to it that you secure as many emergency supplies as possible. That is all. Dismissed! Okay. Okay. Give it everything you've got. Mm -hmm. Hey! <laughs> if Falcon is in the New World, that's big news. But not the good kind. We're in charge of finding any changes in the ancient forest. Let's go on an expedition and have a look around. Oh, Hunter, I'm glad you're here. Do you see that curious creature over there? It suddenly showed up out of nowhere. It must have followed the Tail Raider Safari in the ancient forest and made its way back here. I've tried to figure out what it could be, but I've given up. I haven't got a clue. It doesn't even speak. I'm beginning to doubt that it's from this world, or that it's even living, for that matter. Whatever it is, it's outside my area of expertise. It's best the commander was informed of this. I'll send a feline to fetch him right away. Mind staying around here until he arrives? A peculiar case, to say the least. I'm interested to see what comes of it. I see. I think I understand the situation. Though I'm not really sure what to make of it just yet. Just to be safe, we shouldn't get too close. But judging from the look of it, none of its features seem to resemble anything close to what we know as a living creature. Are you saying that this creature could have come from another world? <sighs> Seems like a lot of that going around lately. I believe we might find the answer to that in the ancient forest, where it was first spotted. There are too many unknown factors that exceed our knowledge. We need to conduct this investigation with extreme caution. It seems it might take a while to get to the bottom of this. If only there were someone who knew exactly what this was. Fleet's research base, to be more specific. And you are? Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. 
was tracking a monster through the forest when, well, I was transported here of a sudden. Must have been magic of some kind that brought me to this world. <laughs> Great. Magic? In our world? This is like something out of a fairy tale. What you're saying is hard to believe. But after what we've just witnessed, I don't think we have a choice. A Necker? Well, well. Quite familiar with those. How'd that one even get here? It came from the ancient forest. If we head there, maybe we can find clues to why you and the Necker came to our world. However, I fear monsters from another world might be beyond what the research commission is capable of handling. Tell you what, happen to be a monster slayer of sorts myself, so... Venture to say I could take care of your problem in the woods. At a price, of course. Deal. We're counting on you. Alright. Let's go over what we know. First, this creature is called a Necker, and it is not from our world. Second, the Necker was somehow transported from its world to the ancient forest. And third, what caused this Necker and our Witcher friend here to come to our world remains unknown. Beast probably dropped through a portal like I did, a different one, wound up in this ancient forest of yours. Worth looking into, I'd say. Anything else I should know? Doesn't matter how trivial you think it might be. Now that you mention it, there have been reports of an unusually large number of revultures recently. They're scavenger birds with black feathers. Scavenger... birds? <laughs> Sounds fun. The Commission will provide support in whatever way we can. I've already sent researchers ahead to investigate the matter. If you cross paths in the forest, don't hesitate to ask for their help. Thanks. Normally, I'd have you handle assignments like this. But given what we know of the situation, I'm leaving this one in the Witcher's hands. Which doesn't mean we can just sit around. It's our job to make sure the Witcher has everything he needs to get to the bottom of this. Yes, sir. Let me handle this one, Hunter. Promise I'll tend to it right away. First Narcacuga investigation in the New World. Talk about lucky! These are Velcana tracks!
is the greatest hunter ever. And I'll be right beside you to record it all. We're halfway there. Hopefully we can find some more Velcana tracks during the next hunt. Gotta have a sharp mind if you want to best a monster with a sharp tail. Be careful out there, Pard. sure what's going on. Uh, Belkan is a formidable creature and is having an incredible effect on other life in the new world. As commander, I'd like to assess the situation with my own eyes. But resources are running scarce. Our duty is to research the ecosystem and maintain balance with it. However, if the entire new world freezes over, that would mean... Hmm. Evacuation. Hmm. Hey, aren't we part of the ecosystem too? Uh, Chief. 
Maybe it's because I was born here, but that's how I see it. By the look on everyone's face, I'm sure you all feel the same way. You've seen how these monsters fight each other. They're out there fighting tooth and nail. It's survival of the fittest. I'm a product of the new world, and I won't leave it behind. If you all feel the same way, then fight for this world! I can't leave yet. Not when there's work to be done. Same here. I got some unfinished business. Then let's fight! As part of this ecosystem! As hunters of the new world! We got this. I need to prep at Celiana. Stay here and hold down the fort. <laughs> okay. You can do this. Just need to track down that Tigrex and Brachydeos.
head back for a quick rest and a bite to eat? If Brachydeos is known for anything, it's slime. That and a pair of guns that'll even make the chef jealous. You've done well. We're the ones to get it done. Before I left, my grandfather gave me this shard. I think he brought it back from the New World. Yeah, I know. The rules say take nothing back. But still, he wanted me to... Partner, tell me. Why do you think people leave their homes, and also their loved ones? knowing that they may never make it back home. I wonder what my grandfather was thinking, bringing this thing back with him. He was a carefree man, but he took researching this very seriously. In the end, he never did find out what it was. 
Why did he bring it back with him? Why me? Maybe he was thinking, she'll get the job done. Forty years ago, their expedition failed, so they left it to the next generation, hoping we'll succeed. And now we're here because someone believed in us. So you know what? We won't fail. I know it. Let's get you ready, partner. There's still work to do. What could have brought Velkana to the Elder's Recess?
Please get up. Fissure runs through here. one step ahead then and now at least you left me some homework what is that everyone's here, let us begin. First, how are you feeling? It's thanks to you that we were able to repel Belkana. We wouldn't have stood a chance on our own. Terrific work. Now then, speaking of Belkana, there's still the question of where it's retreated to. Elaborate, if you would. Gladly, sir. After its, if I may say so, harrowing battle with the A-listers, Valkana suddenly transformed its carapace. And flew in retreat toward the hinterlands. We still have no idea why it transformed, let alone what reason it had for going to the Elder's recess in the first place. And this is just my personal theory, but I think that Valkana didn't exactly retreat. I think it simply left the Elder's Recess after finishing whatever it had gone there to do. What reason could an Elder Dragon from an Arctic environment have for traveling to the Everstream in the Elder's Recess? I believe it might have something to do with the startling metamorphosis of its outer shell. Whatever the case, we'll need to investigate more. One last thing, sir. This newly transformed Valkana seems to be building unbelievable strength. If we don't do something, Celiana could be in danger. Then there's no time to waste. Field team, return to the hinterlands and locate Valkana. Provisions, tech, we need to fortify our defenses. We'll provide weapon support from here in Astera. Be swift, but remember, each careful step or each hasty mistake may be the difference between success and failure. That is all. Dismissed. We have to find Valkana. Let's take an expedition out into the Hoarfrost Reach. The Chief said he was worried about something. I wonder what? Valkana transformed. Its power was overwhelming. A first wave Aryan. Let's ask about Valkana. It's instinct to stand and fight. All we can do for now is press forward. The 
chief said something interesting. The tracker missed her last scheduled contact with base. We know she was investigating the Reach. What could have happened? There's more here! And another set of tracks beside it. Are these human? Human footprints. And on the small side, too. It's gotta be her! They're headed in the same direction as the Valkanas. You don't think... ship looks just like this. I'm sure of it.
You kids saved me again. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so glad you're safe. But really, I knew you would be. <laughs> Guess I gave everyone a scare, huh? <sighs> you know, you remind me of myself. Always finding a way to the truth. Oh, yeah. You're always looking to guide the way. Take a look. More writings from my master's studies. The song, the monster's behavior, they're affecting the ecosystem. Seismic action, the old Everworm. I'm out of time. My story ends here. Songs. The ecosystem. Old Everworm. Uh, is this... about Velcana? The shard originated from here, meaning Velcana's nest must be nearby. Uh. You're right. Its home must be here somewhere. We just gotta find it. So, who's in? I'm in. I want to learn more about Velcana. Together we can solve this mystery and make history. That's the spirit. That monster is growing in power. We can't chase after it now. Let's head back and regroup first. Okay. <laughs> in short, Valkana is presently in the Horfrost Reach. We're certain of that now. So let's just glide over the little spot of trouble I was in and focus on the important matters at hand, shall we? Don't think you're getting away that easy. After we finish this meeting, you'll stick around for some advice from a concerned friend, all right? That said, those notes you found are definitely worrying. Song, impact on the ecosystem, old Everworm. Huh. I'm not ready to buy wholesale into some scratches we happen to find on a piece of cloth, but it's all eerily similar to what's going on. Well, at any rate, this is vital intel. I'll be sure to talk to my old man. Thanks. And be sure not to leave out a single detail, huh? Of course. Now, if we're sure that Velkana is back in the Reach, then we need to hurry with the weapon shipments from Astera. Uh, about that. Just a bit ago, we received a report that a subspecies of Anjanath was spotted along the route to the landing area. What? Why didn't you say so? If the weapon transport comes now, they're gonna get trampled. Sorry to ask you this when you've just gotten back, but could you two go out and hunt that Anjanath? Be on the lookout for the transport's arrival. And once your partner's taken care of the Anjanath, lead them here to Seliana. Roger that. We'll send word if any trouble pops up. I'm counting on you to bring everyone back safely. Good luck.
envoy still hasn't arrived. Think something might have happened? Good to see you back in one piece. Mm -hmm. Yeah. to Astera. There may be something we can help with. Hey. Be careful. You two. Oh, thank the stars you're here. Did my grandson send you? Yes, sir. The Chief asked us to come see if we could help. I'm thankful. You're just the help that we needed. It wasn't long after you left that we started getting reports of the song being heard all around the New World. Soon after that, previously undiscovered subspecies appeared, and wasted no time before starting to run amok. Commander, I have strong reason to believe that the song is what caused the Legiana to fly across the hinterlands. And if monsters start leaving their natural habitats, it's only natural that there are other consequences for the ecosystem. I think this is all tied back to what was written on the cloth. Song and impact on the ecosystem. Ah, yes. I've been told what was written on that cloth. It seems very likely that the Puke Puke and Paolumu subspecies were a precursor to our current troubles as well. I'll be sure to take meticulous notes about where all these monsters have started to become active. Right. I'll leave you to it. Remember, I'm counting on you to help prepare Seliana's defenses. Good luck. More subspecies? Hmm. Are they picking up on some kind of change in the environment? Nothing can stop us! Keeping a record of the monsters being affected by that song.
getting a record of the monsters riled up by that song.
Listen to me. Okay. Get going. Dragon Razor ready. Protect that barricade with your life. You were the only one who's fought this Velcana before. We can't fail here. And you, we need your help with the preparations. Let's get this thing ready ASAP. Got it. Celiana is done for. If you don't drive this thing back, hunters fight hard and stay smart. <laughs> Dragon Razor is ready! Artillery team's in place! Finder Ballista's ready to go, too! First, we need to wear it down! Once it's really here with that fighting! Leave it to us! Assemble the Dragon Razor as quick as we can! Protect that barricade!
Paladin, ready to fire! We've got Velcana bound! Is he? Fear not. He won't be kept down by a little thing like this. Hmm. Hmm. You did a fine job back there. Yeah. But it's not over yet. Hmm. Everyone, good work today. Listen up. We managed to repel the Valkana. But we have no idea if and when it'll strike again. Get everything ready. We need to move fast. Its nest is in the depths of the hinterlands. So I say, let's bring the fight to it! <laughs> Here's something, all right. Go get him! It's us or Velcana. Let's do what we can.
Well done. You've outdone yourself. Amazing. How'd you do it? I can't believe it. Hmm. Formed by magma, cooled rapidly. By using these shards, it's able to control the cold. Then when they weather and fall off, it simply replaces them. Oh man, that's cool. Interesting. Hmm. Remarkable indeed. Oh, wow. You must be excited to see your grandfather now. Yeah. It's just... I have the feeling that there was something else he wanted me to know. He'll let you know. Right. And I'm going to tell him everything. <laughs> uh, partner! For everything you've done for me, thank you so much. I mean you. And then... What I mean is... Greetings. Uh, Back, huh? Nice. Things have calmed down around here. It would appear so. Then please, enlighten me on everything I've missed. Thanks to the Finn. And so, the Legiana resumed their normal routine, and thus we were able to avoid complete disaster. Ah, huh, impressive work. However, I have some troublesome news for you. I'd like to share what I've discovered. But before that... Hmm. We've discovered unnatural fault lines all over this place. Tons of them. This all points to frequent seismic action throughout the area. Seismic action? Right. However, we haven't been able to figure out how this connects to Velcana. That, and we don't know what's causing those songs. Wait a sec. Hmm. It appears that everything is connected. The Legiana's behavior and the rejuvenated Velcana are a simple byproduct of this phenomenon. If we don't put a stop to this, the ecosystem irregularities will continue. Okay, then. What's the cause? <sighs> the old devil worm. just say one thing. The way everyone came together to overcome Valkana, it made me proud to be a part of this team. Outstanding work. That said, our work's not done. Report. I've been conducting an inquiry into the source of the mysterious song reported by the Fifth Fleet. And I've been doing my own separate investigation into the geological phenomenon we're now calling seismic actions. Together, we've realized that the most profound traces of seismic actions happen to be everywhere that the song's been heard. They... they can't possibly be caused by the same thing, can they? The old Everworm. Of course, those might just turn out to be silly words written on a piece of old cloth. But I think whoever wrote them must have had their reasons. At any rate, we need to find more locations linking the song and the seismic actions. The two of us alone cannot cover enough ground. 
I agree. We should look into the link between these two phenomena. Now, what would you have us do? Hmm. I think the Fourth Fleet Hunter should lend a hand with investigating the song and the seismic actions. And as for the Fifth, I think it'd be best for them to focus their sights on monster behavior in each region. Just like with the Legiana, it wouldn't surprise me if other monsters have started getting rowdy too. True. That old Everworm may have stirred up some of the more rambunctious customers here in the New World. I agree with the Chief's plan. If we follow that, then we've all got our parts to play. And we'd better play those parts well. Or else by the time we discover the truth behind this old Everworm, it may already be too late. Okay, let's get to it. Let's get to the bottom of this mystery. We're in charge of the Elder's Recess. Yo. Hmm, check it out. Nergigante thorns. <clears throat> what do you have in your sights this time, huh? <sighs> Business is about to pick up. Hmm. This one.
wrap up the expedition and let's head back. Don't keep me waiting. Everyone here? Perfect. I've got some great news. We found some Nurgigante traces. Great? That's great news? You heard me. Wherever that puppy shows up, it means it's on the hunt for something big. Now we just need to figure out what that something big is. Not only that, but thanks to the Fifth Fleet, we've also found traces of other Elder Dragons in each region. And quite a healthy assortment of Elder Dragons at that. Things are really starting to heat up, huh? How's the investigation into the seismic actions going? Swimmingly. We've been able to pinpoint locations here in the Hinterlands as well as in the New World. We've also been splitting up to search for spots where the song is audible. We should be able to report our findings soon. Great. Keep it up and we'll be able to track down the old Everworm in no time. Speaking of which, I have a request of the Fifth. If I'm not mistaken, we may be able to learn something about the old Everworm from the recently awoken Elder Dragons. At this stage, information is key. I'd like to request a formal investigation into these Elder Dragons. Chief, what do you think? Elder Dragons have always been closely tied to all kinds of natural phenomena. We'd be fools not to investigate them. Great! We'll get started right away. Wait! What about me? Just, uh, do what you always do. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm on it! Okay, let's get to it. This ain't good. Keep it together, okay?
great. Yeah. Let's go. Looks like we'll be needing to investigate the Elder Dragons a bit deeper. Watch yourself. Nothing can stop us. Listen up, everyone. We have the results from our investigation into the old Everworld. I'll go first, then, shall I? After investigating the locations of the song, we discovered something of a pattern. 
These are the locations in chronological order. Uh, pattern? It looks a bit random to me. Just hold on a minute now. Let me add the locations of the seismic actions from first to last. A spiral? It's following the Everstream! Of course. So it's been moving along the trails of energy emanating from the Everstream. Well, just for good measure, how about we tack on that Elder Dragon data that the Fifths collected? Yes, sir. Here's where the Elder Dragons first became active. Amazing. Looks like our teamwork's paid off. So, what's next? Well, we've discovered a remote island by following the line of the spiral mapped out here. If we also take into account when the Elder Dragons first began to appear, then this must be the location of the old Everworm. Now then, we know little about this island. If we go, we'd need to steal ourselves for what may be the greatest challenge we've ever faced. So? What do you all think? Do you even have to ask? Full steam ahead! Agreed. I know you're concerned for our safety, Commander, but we're ready. We've been ready. And besides, we don't have any other options. That settles it, then. We'll send the Fifth Fleet. Our greatest hope. Right now, we need hope. Chief, we'll need your leadership too. I wouldn't trust anyone else to get us back safely. These drastic changes to the environment might eventually snowball into something irreversible. We need to do something before that happens. We'll give the Fifth Fleet our full support. Begin preparations for departure. Yes, yes sir! sir. It's all up to you two now. I'll be sitting this one out, but I still expect to hear all about it when you get back. Fifth Fleet, come to me once you're ready. All right, everyone, let's get to it. Let's board the airship and make for the old Everworm. Yeah. Go get him! This old Everworm, from what we know, has the power to obliterate ecosystems from their very foundation. It's able to use the Everstream to travel underground, and no one knows when and where its influence will be felt. Worst case, this thing really does exist. We must stop it no matter the cost! We don't know what's going to happen out there. But I do know that we will not fail! arrived. The other ones were dismantled, but this one survived. I'm happy. This old girl is getting a second chance at life. 
You're really staying? Well, it was our job to open the path. Their job is gonna be to finish it. Honestly, I'm just happy we were the trailblazers. All right. <laughs> Suit yourself. Hey! Take this with you. No. It, it's yours, and we're going together. <laughs> hmm. This may be a fifth fleet assignment, but your master left you something to find. If you don't chase that truth, then it will be lost forever. Come with us. Well, the Commission ordered us old timers to sit this one out. But personally, I think you need to go. And we can't have you getting in trouble while they're gone, huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> All right. Fine. Let's go.
Are you hurt? Any injuries? Gather yourself. Definitely here.
You did it. Thank goodness you're... I... I don't know how you did it. If it wasn't for you, your partner and I would have had to give up our search. Truly, thank you. I'll record everything. This investigation, the old Everworm, all of it. Got your work cut out for you. Ah, that was truly an adventure to remember. I have nothing to regret. But now, now what do I do? A great woman once told me, you either push forward or go home. There's no time to second guess yourself. <laughs> You're right. Now that we're done here, I'll have to find a new hobby. <laughs> hey! You kids okay? Dude, you were awesome! Good to see you on top. Good work. Bravo! Damn it! Ah, this thing's huge. My word. To think it was meddling with the Everstream. What are you guys doing here? It was the Commission's decision to leave this assignment to the <laughs> Fifth Fleet. But it was my decision that we ought to go. And that's why we're here. <laughs> <laughs> you got the job done, as expected. <laughs> All right, time to head back. Just another link in the food chain. Pressure. I realized I wasn't ready. Maybe I'll never be. I just don't know. But sir, you were great out there. I agree. If I was in a dangerous spot, it'd be fine if, you know, you lost your cool and went a little nuts. It shows that you care. <laughs> Reconsider. Come on, sir. <laughs> All right. Uh, All right. Uh, yeah. <sighs> now that it's settled, what's our next job? Uh, about that. Unbelievable. 
the Legiana Abnormality, Velcana, and the other Elder Dragons were all linked to the old Everworm. That's all we know. We saw with our own eyes what it did when it rooted itself in the Everstream. But despite our best efforts, I'm afraid we're left with more questions than answers. One thing's for sure. It took its sweet time. It crept in quietly, spread its influence, and then... And when things reach a tipping point, the abnormality starts showing up. Wait, if that's the case, won't the ecosystem eventually just destroy itself? No. That's where... Nergi Gante comes in. Uh, hmm. What? Natural purification. Nature. It has unique mechanisms. To detect irregularities and balance itself. Perhaps against such a large irregularity, that balancing mechanism was in fact... <gasps> Nergigante! Hmm. Looks like we still have much to learn. <laughs> Perhaps our work is just one part of our balancing mechanism. Hmm. Nature is... so cool. Hey, stop talking and start eating! <sighs> <laughs> Better get ready for our next assignment. The next one? You know what I'm talking about, sir. Nergigante. We're gonna chase that thing until our legs give out. <laughs> As always, we'll need you. Can't stop now. My work isn't done yet. For helping me discover the story behind this shard, I don't think I can thank you enough. You're really... an inspiration. We all look up to you. And we'll need you now more than ever. It's a lot of weight on your shoulders. But remember, I'll be right by your side. Just like in that story, the tale of the five. Wherever the star shines, the moon's close by. <laughs> now that's settled. Come on, partner. Here's to more adventures. Let's <laughs> you're ready. <laughs> <laughs> 